Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am showing you guys a sneak preview of my outfits for Dirty Bird Camp Out. For those that don't know me, I'm Aid. I'm a music festival content creator. I own vibewithaid.com, which is all about going to music festivals and whatnot. My channel is also about going to festivals, fashion, health and fitness, all that good stuff. And so I am going to Dirty Bird Camp Out for the first time this year, and I'm so, so excited. I believe one of you guys commented on my summer haul video asking to do what else I'm wearing to Dirty Bird Camp Out, and so I decided to show you guys. And I actually have everything in before this festival is even happening. Really excited to show you guys these outfits today. Like I said, I've never been a Dirty Bird Camp Out before, but I do have a how to prepare for Dirty Bird Camp Out as well as a review from a couple of years ago. My friend Jody went to Dirty Bird Camp Out and so I will link her how to prepare blog post and her review down below so you guys can check it out, learn more about the festival and things like that if you are going. I'm really excited to be going for the first times and excited to give you guys all the tips and the tea about this festival. If you are new here, welcome to my channel hit that subscribe button to vibe with me join the little vibe tribe join a little family i love you guys so so much you can also find me on social media at vibe with eight so these outfits i'm really proud of and i can't believe i put them together in a way normally i have my friend rachel her name's little cheese stick on social media and she also runs a styling page called queen of a kind so if you guys need help putting your outfits together definitely reach out to her i will link her stuff down below definitely check her out i still send her all my outfits of like i'm thinking of pairing this with that and she still helps me out because she's the best i love her so so much these looks are very out there so i'm really excited about them i think normally i kind of edge on like the safe side of things so I'm really excited to kind of put myself out there a little bit more with these looks. They were so fun to put together. So yeah, we'll get into them. So some things to think about with Dirty Bird Camp Out. It's in Northern California, so it is going to get colder at night. These were kind of be my like daytime, I guess, outfit into the evening time. And then when it gets colder, I'll probably go back to camp, change into something comfy and all that stuff. Um, I'm not too sure how cold it actually gets, but I do remember seeing that in Jody's blog post that it does get a little chilly at night. So just be prepared for that. First look that I have... You you guys have actually seen this outfit before. I was supposed to wear this to Lightning in a Bottle this year, but I didn't go to Lightning in a Bottle. So then I was gonna wear it to Desert Hearts, Austin. They had like a little takeover. I didn't wear it. <laughs> I was then gonna wear it to Electric Forest, but it was too hot for me to wear the full outfit. So my birthday princess outfit, I am finally wearing you guys, and I'll put some clips of it. Basically, I'm wearing this kimono from the Raving Princess that I've had for a while. It was in my Etsy shop video. And then I'm wearing a bodysuit from Rave After Rave. You guys saw it in my Electric Forest Day 3 vlog. And then I'm finally pairing those two together and then wearing it with a Brits Blossoms Crystal Crown. So I'm so excited to finally be wearing this look. It's finally happening. Ugh, I can't wait. Also, I hadn't gotten this in the mail yet, but I did get a body chain from Moon Chain Body Chains. I will link her down below. She did a custom little pink body chain for me, which I'm also really excited to add to the outfit. You guys know I do love tasteful girls and I am so so excited for this outfit it was in my huge haul video and it's the butterfly outfit I'm seriously here it is again I'm so excited for this outfit and I'm wearing freedom ravewear holographic set underneath it and then I am pairing it with my disco ball headband just because it gives me those vibes that is also from Brits Blossoms guys I'm freaking out over this outfit this is probably one of my favorite Ugh, we love we stand and just so you guys do know I do have a code with tasteful girls do check her out. It's a mother-daughter duo. They are so sweet, so kind, and they are really elevating, I think, the festival fashion game, so definitely go check them out. With all of these brands, I will link them down below, too. Finally, oh, this outfit this outfit you guys so we have like a pink, two pink moments going on so this one is a red outfit and i'm so so excited for this outfit so i've got these bell bottom pants from amazon and then i'm wearing the red set that i got from the raving princess a while back ago that was also in my etsy shop video so that has like a top and a bottom that are red with sequins on it you can't really see the bottoms too well but you kind of can in like person a lot better more than like the photo in the video Video. and then I am pairing it with this hat come on you guys look at this hat 
So I got this hat from Amazon and then Brittany from Brits Blossom, who is the best, she was like, do you need anything for festivals? And I was like, would you be able to like spruce up this cowboy hat that I already own? And she was like, oh my God, yes. So what she did was she added some fluff to it, added some spikes to it, and then she added these red stars to it. So like, so, so cute. I'm so excited for this, like, ah. We, we love we love so yeah that is my last and final alpha for dirty red camp out and i'm so proud of myself you guys it's been like a long path to get here i definitely need to do a video to show you guys like how my festival fashion has like evolved because it's been yeah we've been on a journey you guys <laughs> that is it for today's video i just wanted to give you guys a little sneak peek so if you are going to dirty bird camp out you have some ideas of what to wear i'm really excited about these outfits and i can't wait to wear them i can't we do it a dirty bird camp out for the first time Ugh, i'm so excited like i said i do have a blog post on how to prepare as well as a review from a guest post that someone did for me on my website i will link those down below if you are going to dirty bird camp out please let me know i would love to meet you i'm so excited and i will see you in the next one bye <laughs>